Hi everybody, this is Jill for today. Thank you for coming to my kitchen. Well, we're gonna make some really far out vegan muffins today. They're delicious. I, I did wanna, first of all, just mention my beautiful apron again. This was made by my dear friend, Kat's mother, who just recently passed away. And this, these were always her gift of love, was making aprons and giving them to people. So I just wanted to thank Kat again and thank her mom and in that way. It was a wonderful gift. Okay, let's get started on my muffins. In the bowl here, I have some beautifully whole uh, grained uh, flour that I actually milled in my own uh, grain mill. And I have some brown sugar, some cinnamon, there's a, a little bit of salt, baking soda, and what else is in there? Baking soda, cinnamon. And I'm gonna just give this a stir to break that brown sugar up and get it incorporated into that flour. All right, that's pretty good. Those little brown sugar nuggets will dissolve when I add the wet ingredients. So I'm going to set that aside for now. And I'm going to bring a bowl in here that's going to be my wet ingredients. So I've made a couple of flaxseed eggs, which is, of course, flaxseed meal with some water. And I'll have the uh, little recipe for you down there in the description box for that, along with the, the remainder of the recipe. So I've got that in there. And I'm going to put in about a half a cup of applesauce. This is going to help reduce some of the sweetness. Um, you know, I don't have to add um, more sugar than need be and um, don't have to add as much oil. And I'm adding four tablespoons of just a good vegetable oil of your choice. I'm going to add a teaspoon of vanilla and you know me, I like to hit a little heavy with my vanilla. There, that's my little heaviness there. And then I'm going to add a little of the apple cider vinegar which is going to help that baking soda lift up this muffin mix. So I'm going to put just a teaspoon, two teaspoons of this in there, a teaspoon for each of those flaxseed eggs. This one and two. Okay. So we're going to give this a good, good mix. Use this again and move that out of the way. This is a great recipe. It's got so many wonderful nutritious things in it and it's a great way to start your morning or have an afternoon break. All right, that looks pretty good, doesn't it? I'm going to bring in my dry ingredients here. And now I'm going to add the wet ingredients to those dry ingredients. And I'm going to stir this up. And then I'm going to begin adding all of the wonderful things that are going to go in this batter. You know what's interesting about this, I've made this recipe and tweaked it a half a dozen times, but you know, this needs a little milk and I'm going to get a little milk from my refrigerator. All right, I'm going to add a couple of tablespoons here of just soy milk, just to give it a little, uh, a little liquidness there. It was just too stiff. And because I have carrots and all those other good things to add in here, we needed a little moisture to carry it on through to the end. Okay, all right, let's get moving here. We've got some chopped walnuts. And then I have some chopped apple, some shredded carrot, and some raisins. Doesn't that look healthy? And I'm now going to get this all mixed up. And once I have this combined, I will bring you back. Now, this is all combined. Everything's well incorporated and spread out amongst that dough. So I'm gonna bring in my handy dandy. This is my new OXO scooper. Um, it's just like your old fashioned ice cream scoop. And it's about a half a cup, maybe a little, a little more. So I'm gonna give this just a, about a half of one of those and pop that in there. And these muffin cups, should be about two thirds full. And uh, once I have this uh, completed, we'll be coming back. There we are. It took exactly the 12 uh, muffin cups. Everything is in there. There's nothing left in the bowl. So these are ready to go into the oven. I'm gonna put them in the oven, center rack, of course, at 350 degrees preheated oven. And they're going to cook 
mm, 20 minutes. I'll check them about 20 minutes in with that toothpick test, and if they kind of, you know, that comes out clean, then they're done. If it's still a little, you know, doughy, you might want to put it in mm, maybe two minutes more and then check it again. And uh, once these are baked off and ready to, you know, take a look at, we'll be back. They are out of the oven, and they took 23 minutes in my oven. So let's come on down here and take a look at these beautiful muffins. It turned out very, very nicely. And they smell great while they, they were cooked. They do. So let's get a taste, huh? Yeah. Are you ready to taste? I'm always ready to He's taste. He's always ready to taste. Let me bring it up here to the camera so you can see it. And there's the sides, mm, tall. And the you bottom. You can see the apple mm -hmm. sticking out the side. And the carrots. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah, yeah. All right. All right. I love it. Ooh. It's my I, favorite part. Let me I'll bring it on the inside here so you can mm -hmm. see it. There we are. It smells good. It does smell good. The apple still looks wonderful. moist. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. Mm hmm You know what's neat about the apple in there? It's a soft. It's almost, well, it's not applesauce, but mm -hmm. it's, it's soft. No, it is soft. It's not crunchy. But it's delicious. Mm. Whole wheat. Wow. I ground my whole wheat today. You get the corn and the nuts. Corn? Not corn. Carrot. Mm hmm. <laughs> carrot. I do know the difference between a carrot and corn. Mm hmm. Mm. Yeah. Very good. It's very good. Very moist. Oh, very moist. Mm hmm. I have tw uh, this is a recipe that I've had for a lot of years. And every so often I just kind of redo it and make it a little bit better. This one I've done vegan. Now. This one's great. It's delicious. Mm -hmm. All right. Well. Everything you saw me cook with today, you'll find in my Amazon store, so check that out. If you liked what you saw, I hope you'll subscribe. Give me that old thumbs up down there. And I think that's it. Eat muffins. We'll see you next time. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye-bye.